teach you how to cook a, you know, a simple morning menu uh, with my miracle pan, no oil. Say, you know how to do it. We're, we're gonna fry the potatoes with no oil. So I cut my potatoes in um, half pieces like this. Some people love to put their the skin of the potatoes because that's nutritious according to them, which is um, according to the health of uh, something uh, resources. It's really healthy to have the, the skin, but I prefer not to have the skin. So I peel off the skin. Now I'm frying the potatoes. This is a super fast pan. Uh, order now is $35 the free shipping you know so super fast pan it's not an ordinary pan it came from Israel so this, this pan came from Israel okay so you just do that like that make sure make sure the the, uh, the the pan is hot when you put the when you put the when you put the, the potatoes make sure the, the pan is is hot for like leave it for two minutes before you put the potatoes so what you can do is just a sprinkle uh, just an easy and simple person sprinkle salt okay and sprinkle black pepper for a taste just put black pepper a lot of black pepper just do it like that no we don't need an oil you know just keep doing it yes uh, close it for a minute just close for a minute okay so let's check the potatoes after two minutes after two minutes of the miracle pan, look at that. It's almost like that. It's after two minutes putting the potatoes. Okay, we're gonna make it like five minutes, okay? If this is after two minutes. So we're gonna make it like a little bit uh, more crunchy. So this is after two minutes. We'll wait for a few minutes, like another three minutes and it should be okay. Okay, another two minutes. After two minutes so all in all like four minutes these are all like four minutes cooking and I think they are tender already and it's ready to it's ready to eat so I think this is good enough you know if you want to cook more like uh, make it more brownish or crunchy you can you can make it more like maybe five six seven minutes but four minutes cooking is good enough so I'm gonna put this now here on the plate now I'm gonna I'm gonna teach you how to make eggs um, more. Okay, I beat the eggs with uh, I I beat the eggs with red peppers. I beat the eggs with red peppers, and I put salt and pepper ready. Now you want more? Uh, you want more to increase the egg? Let's say eggs now is expensive, and you want more eggs. If you want more eggs. To have more eggs in the pan, what you do is um, you you put more milk on the eggs, at, and it produces more eggs. What you cook, okay? Oops, sorry about that. We'll put it back here. <laughs> so the milk went in there, okay? So you just uh, whisk it. Uh, it has to put in a in a big uh, container. So there was a beat eggs and then you put the milk. Okay, now I'm gonna teach you how to make a uh, what do you call this on the beat eggs hash brown. So we we'll, we we'll put the the bread in there, you know, and you put it on the beat eggs. Just put it there, no oil. Some people can put butter, but I don't feel like putting no butter, no oil. So we cook. We cook. We're gonna make a hash brown out of that. The beet eggs that we made. Okay. Hash brown.
That's the hash brown I put. Let me see. There you go. See that? Easy. Hash brown. Brown now. That's the hash brown. Out of the eggs that I beat, you made a hash brown. So for you, for your breakfast, you have you have your potatoes, fried potatoes. Yummy. The taste is just okay. Not too much salt, but a taste of black pepper is good. Okay. So we're waiting for this hash brown. What can you put on the hash brown? Uh, syrup, like a pancake syrup, or maybe a fruit, a fruit uh, jam. Strawberry, grape, whatever you want. Okay, here you go. Hash brown. Made a hash brown. And now we're, we're going to cook the eggs. Remember, I only have two eggs, but now it's going to be more. Because I, I, I put some more milk. Because you want to put, uh, you want to make some more um, eggs out of the two eggs, you know. Out of the two eggs, you want to make more eggs. So, by uh, just gonna do it like that so I put pepper red pepper um, uh, salt salt and black pepper is now the breakfast up here while wow, wait, waiting for the eggs you can put something on the you can put already something on the hash brown so I can put like uh, you can put butter also. I put I put uh, strawberry jelly. Okay, I'm gonna put strawberry jelly on my hash brown. Or you can put a pancake syrup, you know, if you want to. So we check the eggs right now. See how much eggs you can make by adding a little bit of milk so that you can have more eggs you know because eggs now went up so high I don't understand why when uh, what happened it's not a lot of chicken no more uh, 2022 the prices went up all prices went up on 2022 the year goes up the prices goes up too what in the world is going on see see how my eggs is so this is the secret of the restaurant you know I am just uh, making experiment it's good to make experiments so, because when you make experiment you learn to cook experiment in cooking you know when you do experiment in cooking you learn more you learn more in cooking you know the, 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 the eggs and now uh, you're ready to eat um, you can add more a little bit of pepper black pepper so it will look better okay are you ready to eat you know what I mean so this is uh, ready to to take out but there's uh, the producing juice of the milk in there it's a miracle and you can just take it out like this okay you don't have to put the the, the liquid on it okay you don't need that liquid you go it's the breakfast this is now the breakfast here's the breakfast you can see now the breakfast right here and then you can cut some oranges. You can cut oranges. Your breakfast. Good morning, guys. Your breakfast with my miracle pen. With my miracle pen. You go. Breakfast of uh, fried potato, eggs, and hash brown out of my miracle pan no oil so you see this one here um, you see it produces oil and everything what you do is just wipe it off if you want or and rinse it 
with soap and water or just put in dishwashing and it looks new again see it, it there was no rust or anything no rust or anything you can just wipe it off like that so nothing no rust no nothing you can just rinse it or soak it with dish washing liquid and it's brand looks new again this is a super fast pan miracle pan $35 order it now it made from Israel you can find it in the supermarket God bless you and here's the here's the breakfast for you it's time to eat breakfast time come and join me hi someone asking why is my pan is sparkling like a diamond it is sparkling like a diamond diamond because it is an aluminum diamond diamonds are forever so whatever you do with this pan it remains forever the same there is no rust there is nothing there's no uh nothing even if you if you uh, if you cook something very sticky it won't stick on the pan it is aluminum diamond uh it's durable it's not gonna unless you break it unless you break it you ruin it then that's the time it ruined but it stay durable and this is the best friend of all mothers you cannot find it in the supermarket it is anointed by a blessed man of god uh from israel so the miracle pan of sister baby is now on sale so get your get your order right now because it is really a miracle it can fry it can bake it can it can cook anything it can it can it can uh, grill any kind even the stickiest one of all it will never never ruin your pan like uh, ruin your pan it's always new it's always the same so get get it now get it now order it now god bless you it is a sparkling diamond because diamonds are forever